James Reimer, the oldest Red Wing, is making his first home appearance. Huge stops and a shutout in Columbus. Was Sherratt, but no harm done there. Larkin brings it in with a little room now. And he got closed on by Weger. Back in front for Raymond. Moving in comes Hall. Hall's got it. Look to the middle. Scores! The break at! Who else? With his young son, Archie. Well, it was almost a broken play. But Hall alertly goes back of the net and somehow this puck finds a way through the goaltend back of the net Braun using his body strong back to the line for a haul for Sherrock found a lane scores Sherrock from the blue line on a feed from Hall who's got two assists and Sherrock's got his second goal you're right by Ben Sherratt. <laughs> wow. But did Valeno tip it? Let's see. Maybe, yeah. Yeah. Okay, it's Valeno. Well, he's on fire, too. Got two goals in Ottawa. And that went off his leg, and it looked like it did. He. Brinkett goes back for Sider, across for Gostas there. That's deflected, but picked up by Debrink. 25 to go in the period. There's a shot tape. Free battle, oh, wow. and that got blocked on the way through. The first one, not the second one, but Boyd prevented the third one. A save there from Uyghur and Mick, and then the next save is yeah. the best. Yeah, let's see. Debrink on the short side. There's a, another look at the right hand off of Uyghur. That puck's going in the net. Debrink right hand shot on the left side, and the goaltender out of position for sure. And uh, boy, oh boy, I'm telling you. The Brinkett uh, is it as usual. Off the rebound to Brinkett. Goss the pair again now for Sider. 18 to go in the period. Larkin down low with it. Crossed by Perron. There's oh, a shot. Oh, Ladar got one. down on that one on Goss to spare. He's at the right time to get those chances. And here is the chance that blew it right into him. It's Goss to spare who's got that offensive mind working all the time. Red Wings won five straight, something they're trying to accomplish early this season. As the Flames fired in, the Red Wings defend the goal to our left, and that shot goes high and wide for Michael Back. Back to the line, moving in, halfway came Hall. Into the slot again, great shot. The brink it just missed on a nicely set up feed from Larkin. To bring it again, back of the net, taken out by Hannafin. Hannafin's been out there for 90 seconds now on this shift for Calgary. Knocked down by Raymond. Chirac. The shot was deflected in by Valeno for the Red Wings' second goal. Chirac's got it again, goes into the corner. And again by Hannafin. Larkin. Across now for Debrinkus. Back across for Larkin. Scores! Oh, my goodness. Are you serious? We have seen Dylan Larkin score goals from this position. Almost down near the goal line. Long distance pass. Holy mackerel. That's the way to pick the top corner. And Larkin practices this every day those goalies go down on their knees Comper again with good work Lada back his way Comper again look out front he had a lot of time there's a shot and a chance for Kopp the pace with which the Red Wings is playing are playing is uh, really responsible for the, the results that they get it. they are really really working hard and using their speed Couple of whacks at it by back, then they score. Mangiapani. Shot, skate. Shot, rebound, and uh, perfect position for Mangiapani. Nobody in front of him. Back and forth, back and forth. They hit Goss to spare a couple of times, and finally the King of the Flames were able to 
tap it into an empty net. So Reimer's shutout goes to the the wayside. Comes into the corner now for Dylan Dubé. Felt pressure from Sider coming. Didn't handle the puck cleanly. Then ahead for Raymond. Along with Larkin. Great feed of Oh my. Scores! What a feed! Larkin to break it! It's 4-1! Well, there's a the response I was referring to. And those two lead the National Hockey League in points now. Larkin and Dabrinka. Goaltender has pretty much got to play Larkin. And that's why when he makes the pass at the last second, what a great pass by Raymond. Under the heel of the stick, in front of the skates. And Alex Dabrinka with a tremendous... Staggered starts across the league. The Red Wing puck drop that night is at 8.23. 7.30, though, will be on the air. Red Wings live. Nick, you won't get home until 11.30 or so. That nice. Late start. Like old time hockey. Scores! Oh. oh, a shot from Sharon Govich. Wow. His first is a flame. It's a knuckleball. And it looked like he saw it because he moved his right blocker up in the way. I don't think it hit Sider's stick. But like he's looking, like where is it? Did not hit the stick. It just a, it's on it's, it's a yep. waffle ball. They might have to bring a tape for Archie. Yeah, I remember maybe. down the road, right? That's right. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, he's under two, so yeah. Either but way, smiling as he work. came in today, Mick. Yeah. Must have known what was to come. Puck got deflected and knocked down for Valeno. A goal in this game for Valeno has three the past two. He's got it again. And a save by Vladar. Ken got through the game. And texting with him today, he is in okay spirits. And Ken, get well soon. Get behind the mic soon. We all wish you all the best. We'll see you here soon. Scores! Right off the draw. Wallman! That's for Cal right there. It's 5-2. It doesn't take long for Detroit to regain the three-goal lead. Nice win there by Perron after Valeno was yeah. tossed out. So three-goal lead restored. Look at Dabrinkit. Dabrinkit is in the shot. Scores! Patrick! I, I don't have the right angle from here yet, but Raymond makes another beautiful play. Watch, watch him pull it, snap it, over the blocker, in the top of the net. Boy, oh boy, oh boy. I don't know, but Archie may have to come to every game. I guess. Keeper, keeper. <laughs> Holy mackerel. Wow. <laughs> Raymond and Hall assisting. Hall's got three assists. And he's plus four. Now that makes him plus five. As the fans count it down. Red Wings with a fifth straight win.